Hi, I'm Doyle Bishop with Tulsa Heaters Midstream. On this channel, you can expect to hear about all things related to process heating, but sometimes the topics aren't technical, but most of the time they are, so thanks for joining. Natural gas pricing is, is really low right now. It's Gas is very, very cheap. And uh, the drivers to that, obviously, are oversupply. Obviously, that's almost always the driver. But why are we oversupplied? We're oversupplied mostly because uh, we didn't get a big winter. Uh, the winter that we thought we were going to have either here and in Europe, it just it didn't happen. And so winter heating was not what we thought. And so there's just a bunch of overstock natural gas. The other thing that happened was there was the price drove up really high uh, after the, the invasion of Ukraine because everyone felt like, hey, Europe is going to be without natural gas. Uh, and so there was a big push to, to secure natural gas supplies and drove the price up. And it's we're in the $2.50 range right now. And I think we were up to like $8. Uh, about a year and a half ago or about a year ago. So in the short term, uh, it looks like natural gas is going to be a little bit depressed, uh, which obviously is a driver for new gas production. Uh, however, in our industry, it's not just natural gas wells. There's associated gas, which their uh, producers are trying to get oil. And so if they get oil, they get usually get gas with it and if they get gas with it they have to do something with that gas which is process it and that's that's midstream so there's a little bit of uh independence there from gas pricing on uh capex for natural gas production facilities due to associated oil but overall looks like it's going to be soft for a bit uh but of course as you know, supply and demand dictates when it's soft and people quit drilling for a while and when they quit drilling then hey there's the supply goes down and then the prices go up so it's just typical economics for natural gas and we're kind of at the bottom end of it right now uh, if we have a really hot summer uh, there's another uh, big use that's another big user of natural gas is is power generation so if we have a really hot summer in, in here in europe it could drive natural gas prices up and Right now, today, it's pretty hot. So uh, maybe we'll have a hot summer and, and it could impact gas pricing uh, in, the, in the near term. Hey, thanks for joining. If you enjoyed this episode, hit like or subscribe to get more information about process heating and Tulsa Heaters Midstream.